So the first thing you want to do is go to this link in the description and scroll down to find the latest example pack, not the pre-release one. Then you click to download the .zip file. Find where you have downloaded the example pack and right click it and press extract all. Choose where you want to extract the file and press extract. Now go to your desktop and make a new folder and name it whatever you want. I'll bring your example folder back. Open it and click Bedrock Sample and Resource Pack. I'll copy Pack icon and manifest into your Texture Pack folder. Now inside your Texture Pack folder, make a new one called Textures. And inside that folder, make another folder called Items. Now go back to your Example Pack and press Item. Now pick any item you want to change the texture of and copy the texture to your own items file. Now you can open the texture with any apps that you can change it with. And I'll just show you here quickly in Paint 3D. Now double click your manifest to open it on Notepad. And now go to this website link in description to copy two different UUID in these two places. Now once you have finished making all the texture, change the code and change the pack icon if you want to. Then you can select everything and right click and send to zip file. After you have created the zip file, you can name it whatever you want. Then you go to the top bar and you press view. Then check the file name extension is on. Then change the .zip to .mcpack. Once you have done that, you can double click the .mcpack file. It should open Minecraft automatically for you. Then you have to go to settings and activate your pack in Minecraft. I didn't name the texture pack here, but you can change it in the code. Now we're in the world. If we search Apple, we should see our YouTube logo Apple. <laughs> and so this is a really quick tutorial. Let me know any question in the comments.